Hello guys, today we'll keep unveiling the beauties of Chiapas after visiting the majestic Palenque. It's time for some waterfalls and rivers. There are three places you can visit from Palenque, Agua Azul, Misola and Roberto Barrios. Today we start with Agua Azul. Just a few things to know before starting. The Colectivo from Palenque charges you 65 pesos and it's gonna leave you six kilometers away from the waterfalls. So from there, you have to take another taxi, which is gonna cost you 30 pesos to get to the waterfall. Once you arrive here, you have to pay two entry tickets, 40 pesos each. This because the waterfalls run along two different municipalities. So they split the earnings between them. Bring plenty of water with you, even if you can buy it here. There are a lot of coconut vendors, which is amazing. You can drink coconut water straight out of the coconut and it's pretty cheap. They charge just 20 pesos. Obviously, keep in mind that we are in the rainy season, so the water is not the blue like during the dry season. Agua Azul is by far the most touristy waterfall around Palenque. You can tell by the hundreds of souvenir stalls along the river and the many restaurants around. As I mentioned before, during the rainy season from July to October, the turquoise color of the water makes space for a brownish one, resulting in not many people visiting the place. But what's not good enough for tourists is perfect for me. Less people equals double the fun, and overall a way better experience. Once you arrive on the last waterfall during low season, they're gonna stop you. Hay personas que molestan pues, por otro lado vienen y... Sí, sí. Ha pasado pues y luego el turismo nos regaña pues mm. porque hay que avisar en qué límite nada más llega los turistas pues. Sí, pero esto está muy solo pues, está es peligroso pues. Está muy solo ahí pues, muy solo. Yo pensaba que el peligro era la corriente, el agua, no, no son las personas. Personas, anda donde quiera, en un pueblo. En un pueblo pues asaltan también, en un pueblo. No hay seguro también en un pueblo. Sí. Peor aquí, peor, peor aquí. <laughs> bueno. Sí, así es. Bueno. You know what? I could have gone ahead because that guy told me that it was up to me. Uh, but if the danger comes from people, no. So let's get back and let's chill on the beach. Hola, ¿qué tal está el agua acá? Buena. Bien fría. ¿Dónde se baja acá? Bueno, me voy a meter. I'm gonna jump with these kids. If there's one thing I love while traveling is connecting with locals. Even better if it means feeling young again playing with kids in a river. Eso me lleva. O sea, ¿tú quieres que nos metemos por allá? Aquí, aquí no hay palo, no hay la corriente, la corriente te lleva allá. No way. Hey, I take right. 
Chegra! Hola, ¿cómo te llamas tú? Jerónimo. Jerónimo. Ne. Ne, quiero lo. Mándame. Very nice kids. You know, one of them told me, "Don't worry, leave your bag here, enjoy the place, swim, I'll take care of it." Sometimes it's just nice to trust people, and it feels good as well. I kept strolling around, enjoying the nature and its serenity. I found a small river beach and stopped there for quite a while. I enjoyed the place for myself until I met a new friend. ¿Está hondo? Dos metros. Dos metros. ¡Epa! It was the moment to embarrass myself in front of these kids. Doesn't matter how many times I try that, I always fail. Oh yeah. Woo. Gracias. There's not much to do around with this rain. The weather is unpredictable in this part of Mexico, so I just stopped for a snack. and a coconut water. Pamela? Pamela? Ay, qué lindo nombre. The rain stopped and the clouds continued with their journey away from Agua Azul. It was time for me to leave. The second place we're going to visit is going to be the waterfalls of Roberto Barrios. Let's see, we arrived. The waterfall are 
150 meters that way. Over here they're gonna charge us for the entry ticket. ¿Cuánto se demora uno más o menos haciendo el recorrido, explorando por Como acá? Media hora. Ah, es pequeño. Sí, tenemos cinco cascadas, pero cerquitas. 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 Bueno. Bueno, listo, muchas gracias. Sí, Entonces este, guardo esto, ¿sí? Este sí, puedes volver, puedes sí. salir a comprar y volver a entrar. Bueno, sí. listo, gracias. Buen día, sí. hasta luego, sí. buen día. This place is way less touristy than the one we saw before. You can tell by the number of restaurants at the entrance. You can see maybe two, three restaurants around and nothing else. We have access to five waterfalls here, so let's try to see them all. All these waterfalls form different natural pools. We are gonna pick one to swim. I found this waterfall and there's no one around. So I think it's the perfect place for a swim. Come on guys, how beautiful is this place? As you will see, each waterfall is different from the other. Some are taller than the others, some pools are deeper than others, but overall, each corner of this place looks a bit like a small piece of paradise. Oh, this is freezing! Oh, oh, oh. That's it! Woo. It's like a natural infinity pool! Amazing! <laughs> This place is just amazing! <laughs> I'm just too happy guys! I could spend here the whole day! What a place! I recommend you to come here early in the morning and to stay here the whole day. Keeping in mind that the last colectivo leaves at 4.30. Also this one has been done guys. Let's get to the next waterfall, Misol Ha. Hola, buenos días. ¿Ustedes van a Misol Ha? Claro que sí, patrón. ¿Cuántos son? Uno. Pásale ahí. Gracias. Welcome to Misola, one kilometer this way. My best advice is to come here, take your time if you can, and visit one waterfall per day. This is what I'm doing. I'm visiting three waterfalls in three days with colectivos. We got some plantains, that's the flower, and that's the fruit. And that's the entrance to the waterfall. 
Muy buenos días. Buenos días. ¿Cómo está? Bien. ¿Usted? Muy bien, gracias. <risa> ¿Dónde viene? De Italia. Italia. Sí. Lejos. Lejos, lejos, lejos. <risa> And that's the waterfall. Among all the waterfalls we have seen until now, this is the tallest one. I'd say, let's jump in before it gets crowded. And with Misala, we visited the three most important waterfalls around Palenque. Of course, I hope you like them. I'll catch up with you in the next video from another remote corner of Chiapas. See you guys. <laughs>